The NASDAQ, it is also down today, 0.81%, closing out the NASDAQ at 17,726.94 points for the NASDAQ composite. And look, we already got some rumble rants here. Rock's ass, happy ball on Friday, ghost. I'm looking forward to this appetizer of the ghost show. We're not doing the ghost show tonight, all right? Too bad. Five-finger prostate punch. If you're not going to do the ghost show, at least do mentions or radio graffiti. How about no? And... <laughs> Oh, Jesus Christ. Can we possibly get no. a video graffiti? Absolutely to end the show not. After tonight? No. Oh, we All would right. be good boys no. and girls. You people have pissed me off. Every time I post a post on X, you stupid man children mess it up. I mean, completely re make it rendered useless because you're man child crap. All right. And no, President Jay, I'm not going to mass unban anybody. Vox Artificial had me Balmer Friday. Linux Chads win again, whatever the hell that's supposed to mean. Uh, anyway, gold is down today. It is down point, or excuse me, 2.29% decrease for gold. Uh, it is down uh, $2,400.10 even for a troy ounce of gold. And oil also took a tumble today. It was down 3.09%. Oil right now is at $80.26 per barrel of WTI sweet crude oil. And lazy dude, I'm not going to sell plushies. Devious Dave, can you refrain from using profanity? My grandma is watching. Well, uh, you may want to remove her. <laughs> All right? You may want to remove her. Oh, we pay you radio graffiti or you're fired? You know what, Froppy? Go piss off. There's not going to be any radio graffiti. All of you stupid troll terrorists, cyber vermin scumbags, just go ahead and do whatever it is that you do on a baller Friday and let some serious people discuss some things. All right? Son of a bitch. And by the way, I had nothing to do with this. Everybody has been asking me. Ah, oh, Jesus Christ. Unblock William Bear asked. I'm not unblocking you anybody. Block him and he wins. Which, by the way, every time you block a troll, they win. No, bitch. no, it doesn't. It means that I don't have to be bothered with your stupid sentence fragment written garbage that is completely unfunny. All right, I don't block everybody. I understand you people are going to troll me and that sort of thing. If you're just going to just continuously tweet at me redundant sentence fragment written unfunny bullshit or some man-child garbage, I'm, you're out of there. I don't need you in my timeline. If you don't like it, well, piss off. I don't give a shit. Anyway, as I was stating before I got rudely interrupted here, uh, once again, I had nothing to do with this. Take a look at this. I had nothing to do with this. Robin Hood lost $2 million to scam artists with names like Ghost and Payday. And look, if this is not me magic, I mean, take a look at the guy that's the alleged scammer here. Uh, oh, well, it, it was some guy named Ghost Hernandez. I am not fucking around. I am not fucking around. Some guy named Ghost Hernandez robbed Robin Hood of $2 million. And that is not me. I just want to let you all know. And President Jay with a rumble rant, largest IT crash in history, and somehow Ghost is still able to stream things that make you go, hmm, I'm going to talk about that, President Jay, if you troll terrorists would stop flapping your fat Cheeto-stained fingers on the keyboard, talking a bunch of malarkey here. But anyway, I just wanted to briefly go over the markets. It was a bad day because of this whole crowd strike nonsense, and everybody's suffering because of it, all right? So with that being said, let's go ahead and look at Bitcoin right now. Bitcoin, once again, is coming off of another bounce from a contraction down to about 56, 57,000 uh, Curtis uh, currently right now. And I put it on X articles. And uh, here it is right here. Put the PC shot on. I'd buy that for a uh, Here we go again. My poopy diaper is packed full with all of your wrong CIA Great. level. Yeah, that's why insight. you're anonymous, you prick. Every bad ta is crammed right and they're stewing and brewing. All right, shut up. And Vox Artificials, Hulk Hogan's speech was kick-ass. Let me get to it, all right? Now, in this, I make a very quick synopsis, which I'm going to go into a detailed explanation right now on this broadcast. But after last night's Donald Trump speech, it is a speech of a man speaking against his will. A man speaking against his will, completely going through the motions. And then we, when he went off teleprompter, <laughs> all right, they didn't look too well. Oh, Are Jesus. you going to tell about the IT crash? It was all over yeah, the news Yeah, we get this it. Morning. Shut anyway, the fuck up. I hope. Uh. Anyway. All right, thank you for the five bucks. You're a stupid idiot for fucking doing something like that. Anyway, as I was stating, whenever Trump went off script last night, his sons, 
Uh, obviously, J.D. Vance, they looked a little uncomfortable, and we're going to look at some of those reactions here in a minute. But let me continue. Oh, we got the Northern Yankee! The Northern Yankee in the house! On a baller Friday! Happy Baller Friday. Happy Baller yes. Friday, man. Let's hear the serious show because there is a lot going on. I'm trying. On. I'm Keep trying. Keep and get these Americans off their asses. Thank you Please very much, man. Graffiti if the show goes well. Have a smoke. If the show ready. goes Cheers, well, baby. this Cheers. show is not going to go well. But hey, I appreciate it, the Northern Yankee. Cheers to you. Happy Baller Friday. And I appreciate the, uh, <laughs> I appreciate the 69. No pun intended. Cheers, ghost. Wish me, Lucas. I am officially back in the job hunt after moving in with the fiance. Oh well, congrats, of course, man. Trying to update the residency at the DMV today. However, the cyber outage caused it to be closed today. That sucks. Cheers, and hope you have a good show. Good luck, Transmoney. Happy Baller Friday. Oh no, here's an audio file, folks. Jesus Christ. Ghost Hernandez. How's it going, folks? And thank you for tuning in with me. What the hell? Another edition of the True Capitalist Radio Broadcast. And of course, I am your host, the man they call Ghost. And I want to thank you very much for tuning in with me. What the hell? Folks, this is episode number 705. Episode number 705 for all the folks that are keeping track of the truth. Who does this? Who did this? Before we get into anything else, I'd like to ask each and every one of you to please spread this show across the internet and throughout the world. Spread it around like wildfire and let every... All right, I'm sorry that we're having to do this. All right, anyway, cheers to Transmoney, and of course, cheers to the Northern Yankee who hooked it up with a 69, no pun intended, all right? Uh, but let's go ahead and get back to what I was discussing, this article where I briefly give my synopsis of last night's Trump speech. Anyway, let me continue. The speech came amidst the backdrop of internal dynamics within the GOP, which I describe as a coup. So strap on, no pun intended, and get ready for this ride, all right? Uh, the big one new, hi, Grandpa. How about talking about what you did backstage with Trump and Elon yesterday? Yeah, real funny, you idiot. All right, let's take a look at Donald Trump Jr. <laughs> I'd buy that for a dollar. Hey, Poppy, why did you ban me? Because on you're a fucking I idiot. I lonely strolling in all right? seeing you. Listen, shut up. Uh, the reason I banned you, urinator, is because you're a homosexual, gay, sexual harasser, and I don't want to see you again, dude. You're a sick piece of trash, and I, just don't even bother donating me. You're a sick fuck, all right? Anyway, can we watch Donnie Jr. here? All right, can we, let's watch We're Donnie like Jr., all right? Now, I would like for you to pay attention to the reaction. Take a look right now. This is the beginning of this clip, and Trump is literally falling asleep to his own junior right now, talking nothing but adulations to him post this supposed assassination attempt. This is how Trump looked throughout the, the whole goddamn event that was the GOP convention. All right? So give me a break. And, and shut up, Five Finger Prostate Punch. It wasn't an AI article, you dumbass. All right? Play this. Let's look, look at Trump and his reaction to Donnie Jr. Look at this shit. We're like that man. What a disingenuous, fake piece of fucking effeminate crap. But that's besides the point. That's besides the point. All I wanted is to soak the sap out of your PP. If I can't have you, I don't know what I'll do. All right, great. I'll carve your name into my ass right. and with a razor. Great, cushion. that's great. Thank you for the five bucks. And Vox Artificial says, hashtag feel the bergdom. But once again... <laughs> I'd buy that for a dollar. Song recommendations. Why don't you tell the people that... Ah, dude, just shut up. I, I, we're not doing videos, all right? There's a video by uh, David, Steve, and Larry that we're going to do on the next Ghost Show, and I'm going to do it on Sunday, Sunday, Sunday. I'm going to enjoy my weekend. I'm not going to have it just completely decimated by you fucking troll terrorists. Now, once again, Trump not showing very much emotion. In that moment. Platitudes. That's when the world found out. Ah, oh, Jesus Christ. Can y'all stop this crap? New York, New York. York, no, York, no, skip York, that York, stupid York, fucking York, shit. York. Shut up! Listen to me. I don't want this text-to-speech shit going on right now. There's a lot of important issues, and you wonder why I don't want to do a ghost show? 
Jesus Christ. That there I is mean, t- look, look, look at Trump. He does not want to be there. This is his junior. Why? Because Donnie Jr. and Eric Trump have turned against their father. And not just they. Everybody that is the MAGA movement has turned against Trump. And Trump has no choice but to continue to go on. And I'm going to continue to explain this if you people would shut the fuck up. Tough. And then there's Trump tough. J.D. Vance, in my opinion, is the homosexual lover of Peter Thiel. (laughs) All right. Oh, Jesus Christ. Hold on. This is an audio file. Oh, come on, man. I'm trying to give a fucking CIA level of assessment here. Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. Come on. What the hell? How long is this shit? Shut this shit up, dude. Shut it up. All right. Anyway, as I was stating, okay, um, Trump doesn't look like he wants to be here. He's about to begin hearing his son Eric talk. And, And look at this. Like I said, I think J.D. Vance, in my opinion, is the homosexual lover of Peter Thiel. Going through the motion speech that Donald Trump did. All right, what, hold on. What is it? Hold on. What is it? He's 80 years old and tired. He got shot at Saturday and had to immediately have to attend a big event for four days straight. Chill out, man. You don't have to do any of that and still miss shows while just well, sitting in a chair well, for three okay. hours. Well, okay. If you're gonna fucking make that excuse for Trump. Well, then shouldn't that same 80-year-old excuse apply to Biden, which is what everybody over there on the left is saying, that they need to go ahead and yank him off the ticket? I mean, I agree with you. I think that he is old, and I think that if we're going to be focusing on people's age, then uh, why aren't we calling for Trump to be taken down because of his age and his inability to be able to uh, stay awake during a convention if you're going to give him that kind of excuse? I mean, come on, Maine. Anyway, the big one, noob. Grandpa, don't lie about yourself. You got the vex. No, I didn't, dude. Absolutely not. Anibus, uh, you know how long Don Jr. has been riding his dad's nuts? Of course he's bored of it, ghost. And we've got Blade the Stellron Hunter. Of course, Mr. Grab him by the pussy would smile to the guy who said the N-word. What a real American, huh? <laughs> I did hear that. Unfortunately, unfortunately, uh, because Hulkster was at the RNC... The uh, hidden recording of him going off on how he doesn't want his daughter to be dating N-words came along, and that didn't really look very good. But, hey, uh, you know, America likes to forgive and forget, right? And Devious Dave, I really do miss the 2016 Trump. Uh, You know what? I'm glad you brought that up because I want to show you some of this. uh, 40 beers? Forty beers. Hey, Red Ball. Cheers to cheers to you, dude. Hold on. Let me take some of these buy me a coffees here before we get to the Trump speech at the last night's Republican convention. First of all, I do want to acknowledge that uh, Dave, Steve, and Larry. We are going to do your video first on the Ghost Show. I am going to do it on Sunday. I know you you all say that I don't do Sunday shows. I am going to do it. I know I need to do one. I just didn't want to ruin my weekend, dude. I didn't want to do a 10 to 12 hour show and then be pissed off for the rest of the weekend when I actually want to enjoy it, all right? So anyway, we got Froppy. We pay you Radio Graffiti or you're fired. Yeah, right. And then Five Finger Prostate Punch, uh, hold on, with the Rumble Rant, they really jamming up the nostalgia crap to get the votes, aren't they? That's what I'm saying. And Urinator said, base Trump. And hold on, song recommendations, Ghost. Uh, why don't you tell people when you and your band, the Hambonios, release this music? Holy fucking shit, is your new song a banger? P.S. I read the description. I can't believe you made it far enough until you needed a break. Play this on the next Ghost Show or this show. Cheers, baby, cheers. Well, this will be the second video we play on the Ghost Show on Sunday evening, all right? Uh, We got Kits Does a Flip since you brought up Trump losing associates. Did you hear about Lou Dobbs croaking? R.I.P. Lou Dobbs, by the way. R.I.P. Lou Dobbs. Um, I'm not sure if that was brought up yet. No, he, I think he died of old age. He was kind of a, 
Always a heavy set guy. I think he smoked. I think I think he was a drinker. So it happens. All right. R.I.P. to Lou Dobbs. Cheers. Happy Baller Friday, and hopefully we'll get a radio graffiti today. I don't know. I don't know. You got Red Ball over here with 40 beers, man. Cheers to Red Ball. Hey, Ghost, love your show. Uh, you helped me get through two of the hardest times of my life, kept me informed and laughing all the way through it, and glad I found you one day while pursuing through YouTube. I always look forward to TCR. Thanks, Ghost. Happy Baller Friday. And cheers, baby, cheers. <laughs> Woo! Anyway, cheers to Red Ball, man. Thank you very much, and I appreciate you. You and everybody who says that I get them through hard times are the reason why I continue to do this stuff. I'm not kidding around. All right, so cheers to Red Ball. Cheers to you, man. Happy Baller Friday to you, and thank you very much for the 40 beers. Those are genuine sentiments, and I really do appreciate them, man. All right? Uh, Anyway, cheers to Red Ball. Let's get back to what I was discussing. We just saw some... Because I want to get to the highlights where they pan to the family and J.D. Vance once Trump goes off script and they don't look too happy. Play it. Wow. And thank you, Dana. Thank you, Kid Rock, sometimes referred to as Bob. Hold on, hold on. We got Gino X. What? What do you think about people being coldish, painting their faces orange, and wearing ear bandages? Oh, jeez. Does it not scare you? A majority of Americans crave a monarch. Oh, this is what I've been trying to discuss, Gino X, 1987, ever since I said I wasn't going to support Trump for this presidency. This is exactly what I was afraid of. All right? That we go away from issues, and all we're doing is being a cult of personality. But you got a good point. Now, let's play the rest of this. Now, once again, just take a look at how he goes through the motions at the beginning. Of our country. Look, it's very nonchalant. Together we will launch a new era of safety. Oh, gee. Here's another audio file, folks. I'm sorry. What the fuck? Don't stop this crap. Don't skip this stupid fucking shit. Shut up, listen to me. I don't want this text to speak shit going on right now. Oh, come on, man. I don't want to do a ghost show. Jesus Christ, that there is. I mean, look, look at Trump. He does not want to be there. This is his junior. Why? Because Donnie Jr. and Eric Trump have turned against their father. And not just they, everybody. Is everything a joke to you, Jagoffs? Against Trump. And Trump has no choice but to continue to go on. And I'm going to continue to explain this if you people would shut the fuck up. So not not very reactionary, considering that that's his junior up there. I'm telling you, man, what a joke. What a fucking joke. You guys, you know, give me a break, man, all right? Now, look, this is not the part I'm talking about, all right? This is the beginning of the speech, all right? Now, watch as he goes off script and they show these folks. Prosperity and freedom for citizens of every race, religion. Just reading a script. The discord and... Division in our society must be healed. We must heal it quickly. As Americans, we are bound together by a single fate and a shared destiny. Hold on, Winston. We rise together or we fall apart. I am running to be president. I got, come on with the damn audio files, man. I got Down you to my heart. Oh, God. I knew you were a Hulkamaniac right from the very what the fuck? You were my friend. Oh, God, what a horrible AI. I'll send you fucking Oh, my God. Learn how to AI, brah. Comes to heaven. No time to appear. Jesus Christ. All right. Uh, this is so stupid. And Vox Artificials, we would take TCR more seriously if it was a musical. Yeah, of course you would, right? I bet you like Yentl, huh? Uh, Vox Artificials, I bet you're a Barbara Streisand fan, huh? And Five Finger Prostate Punch, who donated this crap vid? Can we skip it already? Shut up! I'm trying to make people understand that this Trump is just reading from a script. And when he goes off script, he makes everybody over there in his uh, you know, family area, his sons and J.D. Vance, look very uncomfortable. All right? Now listen to the cadence. This is a different Trump. 
not half of America, because there is no... Get a better phone. Now look, you morons that are saying, oh, there was one. There is a video of him getting shot. This has already been debunked, you idiot. All right? Look at this. Some people are so gullible. This is literally an inverted fucking uh, video from the original. Same stupid blonde bitch in the background. They just switch sides, you dumbass. And added a fucking stupid dot for you people to go and be like, Oh my God, there's real footage. You, you people are idiots. You people are more... And look, there's, there it is right there. This video was horizontally flipped as evident uh, by the MAGA slogan on the hat. All right, visual effects were added to make it appear that Trump's left ear in reverse image had been wounded instead of the right ear. So you people are idiots. Uh, if you believe this, you people are morons. Uh, but then again, it goes to show you how gullible you idiots are, which makes this whole environment that we're in even that much more dangerous. Even that much more dangerous. Look at the original footage. It's the same blonde bitch in the background, you dumb fucks. Anyway, play the, play a little bit more of this shit. All right, play a little bit more. Thank you very much. Hey, President Jay, can't comprehend different angles. Dude, look, I'm, I'm banning you. You want to know why I'm banning you? Because you're a fucking idiot and you're playing into this stupid fucking hoax that some stupid troll actually culminated to try to make himself feel like he's fucking badass, you dumb fuck. All right? I put in the same tweet that I criticized that fake fucking time. Oh, oh, here's Trump getting shot. All right? Here it is. Look. Look, hold on, put the PC shot on, you dumb fucking idiot. God damn it, I hope you're vaxxed, all right? I hope you all are vaxxed. Look, this stuff, this, this stupid right here. Look at these two stupid bitches, all right? Take a look at these two See stupid bitches, all right? Take a, look take a look at these two stupid bitches, all right? Now take a look at the original footage. Take a look at the original footage. What part, if any, did Putin play in the J.D. Vance vice president pick? Uh... I don't know that. I'm, I'm going to get to that. I'm going to get to that. Anyway, look. Take a look at this. All right. Look, I'll cut the malarkey. We're Whoa, wait, wait. I didn't ask for this. Deadline. I didn't ask for this Biden ad. Oh, that's a little... All right, look. There the bitch is right there. The same stupid blonde bitch right there. All right. Look at Same, same stupid bitch. Same stupid bitch. If you uh, want to really right. see something to say, take a look at what happened. Oh. Look at that. Same stupid <laughs> bitch. All right. So give me a fucking break. If you people believe that, then you should just go ahead and maybe consider putting yourself into a home somewhere because you're not mentally uh, capable of understanding reality. All right, so give me a fucking break. Jesus Christ, you people make me sick. Anyway, let's go ahead and go back to what I was saying because everybody's like, oh my God, you know, there is actually a video of him getting shot. There's no fucking video of Trump getting shot. All right, there is no fucking video. There's video of people getting shot on both sides of him at that speech, which I find is ironic. I mean, there were three people to his left that got shot there was that poor guy that was the fireman that got shot to the right of him so who the fuck knows how that happened but you got to figure that out on your own anyway put the pc shot on play some more of this shit and we will do it right gonna do it right I told everybody to tweet at Don Thibud and ask him his gay relations with Kasich, and he completely privatized his Twitter and never, ever made it public again. So don't discredit any publication. Don't discredit any publication, all right? Hey, hold on, here's another I audio file. I nephew. I want to my gay nephew. I want to my gay nephew. Oh, oh, Jesus Christ. Come on! Come on! All right, shut that off. Jesus Christ. Anyway, look, that's the only exp that's the only explanation I can tell you. And aside from Peter Thiel, J.D. Vance has a very close connection with Vivek Ramaswamy. Now, I would like everybody to pay attention that R Vivek Ramaswamy himself came out of nowhere when he decided to run for president in 2024. And he was a guy that was out here that was once... Oh, Jesus Christ, with the fucking audio files, man! Good God! 
Come on! I am Trump Trump. Uh, I am from Trump. Uh, I am who's doing Trump. this shit? I would follow Trump into hell. Oh, you fuck you. Me. Fuck you, whoever the fuck. Your... I am a flaming home. I am the chat's bitch. Who fixed the rage for shekels. You fucking piece. Hey! Skip that shit! Get that shit! Dude, let me tell you something. Y'all better cut the crap, man, all right? I'm, I'm trying to give you fucking CIA levels of assessment here, you piece of crap, all right? That's what I'm trying to do. And instead, what are you people doing? You think it's a big fucking joke. Anyway, as I was stating before I got rudely interrupted, I think everybody needs to pay attention to Vivek Ramaswamy because he's very instrumental. Right now, it's not going to be news. Oh, be this is the longer story. God damn it, you stupid fucking idiots! Enough of that shit! This is important, you fuck! You fuck! You stupid fuck! The level who cares. It does not. God damn it, stupid fucking idiots! And you wonder why I don't do a ghost show for you stupid fucking losers? I'm serious, man. The child has a right to go with the child. No, just, just. I think it's humane. Uh, uh, just shut this shit up. All right, shut the fuck up. All right, you fucking idiots think that this is all a big fucking joke. I'm about to show you proof. All right, that Vivek Ramaswamy is admitting that what's going to happen in the future is that an internal struggle is going to take out Donald Trump. Now shut the fuck up and listen, you stupid waste of human protoplasm. Play it. It's good Thank to see you guys. What did you mean on social media when you said it can be news? Oh, this is a longer story. Dude. All right. Dude, it takes a dark All right. Skip w. it. Skip it. W. All right. Thank you for the five bucks, you fucking idiot. All right. Play it. Play it again. Turn. But I think it's, I know, I, I mean, I have a good sense of what's going to happen here. With Mark Zuckerberg. All right. With Mark Zuckerberg. Do you love tying and rap Alabama black snow but are tired of the herpes, domestic violence, and... Uh. All right, all right. You should try some of my Andalusian dabbled snooey. I haven't given a human woman a baby right. or an STD yet, despite how hard I try. I don't even know why the hell you're even saying that, you disgusted piece of shit. All right? Anyway, as I was stating, all right, Peter Thiel listed in the World Economic Forum official website. So this is how powerful Peter Thiel is. I mean, he can make Mark Cuckerberg, all right, change his mind within an instant. Hey, hold on, here's another. What's being done? Do we lay down our lives to protest in what's being done? What the hell is this crap? The criminality of people, the cruelly people. Who walked out of here today? What is this crap? Monthly white people. What is this shit? This is an audio file, folks. I'm so grateful for the ones that didn't, those who knew who they are. What the hell? There's no, there, there's, there's no point. There's no point to this. We have, we are born before our time. What is this crap? They won't accept it. And I don't think we should sit here and take any more time for our children to be endangered. So if they come what is this children, shit? We need to give them our children. What the hell is that supposed to be? Anyway, we talked about Cuckerberg. All right, how he's changing his tune, how Peter Thiel was the first, one of the first Facebook investors. And what does he say? Come in, the water's warm. Come in, the water's warm. I'd buy that. Who the hell is doing this crap, man? Come on, there's another audio Listen file. <laughs> what the fuck? Come on! I don't know if y'all know that you know. J.D. Vance and Viva Grandma Swaney are such best friends that J.D. Vance named his son Viva. You guys are dicks, man. That he named his son Viva. Now play this because this guy tells the future because he's a bird of the fucking coup that he's describing here. Jesus Christ. God damn it, you stupid fucking idiots. Enough of that shit. This is important. You. I'm trying to give CIA levels of assessment here. You stupid fucking idiots. And you wonder why it'll do a Come on. You stupid for a fucking dollar. loser. I'd buy that for a dollar. It was Joan Massacre on. Whatever, you idiot. All right. Anyway. Um. Oh, you're talking about the last audio file? 
thanks a lot, asshole. All right, let's take another uh, buy me a coffee here, and then we're going to get back to what I'm discussing here, all right? Put the PC shot on. Okay, we got song recommendations. Here are two beers for my video on the next Go Show. Also, what time on Sunday? 8, 8 p.m.-ish. All right, song recommendations, 8 p.m.-ish. And hold on. Hey, Safe Space Dally, why do you exactly read actual fact checkers instead of listening to Blue Ann and liberals on X? Instead of banning me from chat, I give you money for Christ's sake. I don't want your fucking money, President J. All right, you're a fucking stupid idiot. All right? Fucking idiot. And uh, American Anime Otoku, talk about the mass synchronized blue screen of death that is going on. Well, I'm going to talk about that here in a second because that plays a part in the coup that is happening right now. That's why I'm trying to throw all this information at you, which I know many of you attention deficit disorder fucking scumbags are not going to be able to pay attention to everything that I'm putting forth here. So, I mean, come on. I, I mean, I, I need to be bailed out. I got to send my kids to some private boarding school here. What are you talking about? Bail them out. Ba oh, shit. What the fuck? Come on. Oh, you son of a bitch. You son of a bitch. You guys are son of a bitch, dude. Alright, I, I am really fucking tired of this. I'm giving CIA levels of assessment here! Jesus Christ, man. You know what? You feminine penis-loving, autistic, anal-licking, meat-gazing, Lena Dunham fucking licking pieces of two girls and one anus shit. Enough! All right, I'm giving you fucking CIA levels of assessment here, for fuck's sake. And do you all give two rats asses? Of course you don't. Anyway, that's David Sachs for you, all right? That's the kind of guy David Sachs oh, is. I'd buy that for a dollar. And what's up to someone? I'll get to you in a minute. All right, cheers to you. Now, folks, now many of you are asking, well, okay, ghost. Validating that Peter Thiel has had private meetings with Putin. All right. Now, why the hell would Peter Thiel have private meetings with Putin? You know what I'm saying? Oh yeah. Get you know get all these people out of here. Get them all out of here. All right. Get them all out. Get them all the fuck out of here. And I'm not unbanning you either. Y'all can go fucking piss off. All right. All right. I don't care if you fucking donate to me. Get the fuck out of here. All right. Get out. Get the fuck out. <laughs> fucking piece of shit. Ghost is awfully grumpy today. He's clearly on his period. Donate him a dollar, guys. He needs to get himself a chocolate bar. That'll not eat him feel better. <laughs> yeah, 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 whatever, whatever asshole, all right? Milk, whatever asshole. And a friend's box set. All right, you know what? I'm done. I'm done with this show, all right? I'm fucking done with this show. I'm telling you, I, dude, listen to me. Hey, Vox Artificials and all you fucking trolls, I don't like you fucking people, all right? I don't care how much you donate to me and shit. I don't fucking like you people. I wouldn't piss on you if you people were on fucking fire. You're a waste of human life, all right? You fucking people that are fucking trolls are fucking stupid waste, a pile of human protoplasm, and you make me fucking sick. Anyway, Johnny come lately, you were ride or die with Putin back to... That's a fucking lie. Either bring it up on a fucking audio file or it's a fucking lie. All right, Vox Artificials kicking me out of the chat, proving me. No, look, Vox, I don't like you. Look at you. You got a. F look at this. You got a fucking stupid little fucking twelve-year-old girl as your fucking profile picture. You fucking idiot. All right, you got a fucking twelve-year-old girl as your profile picture. Go fuck off. All right, fucking piece of shit. I'd like to see what's in your fucking history. You sick son of a bitch. Jesus fucking Christ. Anyway, look, I'm getting the fuck out of here. I'm certainly not going to have my fucking goddamn weekend ruined by a bunch of cyber vermin, butt dart playman, fucking autistic, anal loving, trailer park trap rimming trolls. All right? I certainly don't fucking need that shit. Jesus. Oh, look, look here, here are the pro fucking anime people. Oh, it's just, it's just cartoons, ghost. It's, it's just cartoons, man. <laughs> fucking sick assholes. All right. Why do you think I don't give a fuck about, you know, confronting anybody in a global capacity? All right. I think we need a war. 
not only do we need a war so we could show America's dominance, but we need a war so that many of you people can go out and make something of yourselves instead of being a bunch of weak pieces of shit that are effeminizing yourself because you're obsessed with some fucking Japanese cartoon. I'd buy All right. For a dollar. Oh, oh, look at Froppy. Chill, dude. God, you're such a loud asshole. Well, you know what? Fuck you, Froppy, all right? You call me Mr. Asshole, all right? All of you, it's Mr. Asshole. Buy that for a you fucking piece of shit. Oh, says the guy that shielded Peppermint Swirl and Jagger. Hey, Vox Artificials, you're one to talk, dude, all right? You should, hey, uh, you shouldn't be going out there and hanging out in these stupid, dumb fucking uh, uh, discords, all right? trying to do whatever it is, whatever nefarious things that you're trying to do, you fucking freak. Jesus fucking Christ. You know what? I'm getting my fucking smoke. Give me a, give me a smoke, all right? All right? If you're with the trolls, get the fuck out of here, all right? If you're with the fucking trolls, get the fuck out of here. I don't want, I don't want you to fucking listen to me. I don't want your fucking money. Go fuck yourselves, all right? I'm tired of you fucking people. All right? And fuck you, belligerent Brian. You're another fucking cock the fuck out of here, for Christ's sake, you broke dick son of a bitch. Jesus fucking Christ, man. You see, I, I wanted to fucking enjoy my weekend, and this is why I did not do a, a ghost show. Alright? We didn't do it. I didn't do a ghost show. So anyway, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take this fucking tobacco that I got from a Mexican kid that sells candy apples on the corner, which is called Midnight Blood Fart, and I'm going to do me for a second, all right? Buy that for a dollar. Name one nefarious thing I do. You cope pretty hard. You obsess over 12-year-old animated girls. That's all I got to say, all right? Anybody who's over the age of 18 years old that is putting fucking 12, 11-year-old girl animations on their profile picture has a fucking problem. And I hope that you're on a list at your local PD's vice squad because if there's any kind of goddamn sexual fucking goddamn crimes that happen in a five-mile radius of your fucking house, you should be the prime suspect, you fucking idiot. Anyway, sorry about that. Let me go ahead and take a smoke. I'm sorry that y'all are watching. I'm sorry y'all are hearing this. All right? I'm sorry. Give me a smoke. All right. All right. I'm just, I'm just saying. And look at Red Eyes Black Dragon said, half these guys deserve Kiwi Farm pages like Peppermint Swirl. <laughs> well, you know, I'm not saying anything about that. I'm, I'm just saying, man. All right. I'm tired of these stupid fucking trolls that are, they're just fucking useless human beings. All right. They're just useless human beings, and I wish they would just go away from my show, all right? I wish they would just fucking go away, because I don't like them. I would never be friends with these fucking pricks, all right? I would never fucking hang out with these fucks. I wouldn't have a beer with these fucking jerk-offs. None of that shit. None of that shit. Stupid fucking son of a... I'm fucking tired of you fucking people, man. All right? Jesus fucking Christ. Oh, oh, we got Nick Fuentes simps. Oh, I don't think Nick Fuentes needs drugs to talk about politics. <laughs> Who gives a fuck about that fucking goddamn taco eater, for Christ's sake, all right? You white people are out here fucking praising some guy that should be serving me fucking salsa in the back of a taco bar, and you're talking shit? Shut up! All right, just shut the fuck up! Fucking piece of shit. Give me a smoke. That's it. That's it. Gotta, gotta hold it in and let it hit the brain, baby. You gotta hold it in and let it hit the fucking brain, all right? God damn it, you son of a bitch. All right. You know what? I'm going to get the hell out of here. I wanted to talk about some other stuff, you know, that was very important. But, of course, you know, you fucking trolls, it ain't going to get serious until you people are drafted for World War III. So... I mean, I hope that that happens. Let's just put it that way. I hope that fucking happens because you all deserve it. You all fucking deserve it. Let me acknowledge these buy me a coffees and get out of here. All right? I deserve more respect than this. And what is this? We got Vox Artificial. Says the guy who still did Peppermint Swirl and Jag. <laughs> hey, name one nefarious thing I do. You fucking idiot. This is nefarious. All right? You being a 20-something, at least I hope you're 20-something, I hope you're not older, a 20-something-year-old man obsessing over 12, 11-year-old looking pre-teenage girls that are animated from Japan, all right? So give me a fucking break, all right? Give me a fucking break. Ghost, 
I wouldn't drink with you either. I don't think it's morally right to support an alcoholic's addiction, Lee E. That. Also, bend over and I'll show you how pro E my dick is. Yeah, Daddy. of course, homosexuality. <laughs> That's what I figured. I buy that for the a sign on my ass says, "Do not enter." You do realize whenever you don't do the ghost show, you just invite and instigate them to go to TCR. I hate the ghost the show. Answer to getting rid of the trolls on TCR is simple. I hate Before, the ghost show. Ghost shows, Sunday, Tuesday, Thursday, or Friday. Dude, it's I, not hard. I hate the ghost show. I hate the people it attracts. <laughs> I hate it. All right, I fucking hate it. Dad over Vox having an anime girl is his prophet's pick that you eat pedophiles. Lay EJ money in your TCR chat. Yourself, you pose whole ally seeing tub of melted mint ice cream loo in college frat boy ham bone. Yeah, it really makes a lot of sense with those sentence fragments. All right, you got to go back to whatever college you went to and get your fucking money back. All right, give me a fucking break. And what, Vox? What now? Oh, thanks for plugging your fucking goddamn buy me a coffee. Who gives a shit? Jesus fucking Christ. You see what I got to put up with here? You see what I, you see what the fuck I got to put up with, man? Like I said, the fucking people that are flapping their fat fucking ham bone fingers on the keyboard, talking malarkey in these goddamn chat rooms, these are the kind of people that during Halloween time, when kids come up to them asking them for a Jolly Rancher candy, they tell them to go fuck a farmer. All right? That's how these fucking people are, and these are the fucking people I'm broadcasting to. Jesus Christ. And hey, urinator, did you talk about how the shooter was looking at porn before he attempted? You're talking about that OnlyFans account that you forwarded to me? It was already debunked, you idiot. All right? So stop putting about three or four fingers in your ass, gyrating it counterclockwise, and then putting it in your mouth and think that that's how life's supposed to taste, all right? And that's not how life's supposed to taste, all right? You fucking Hershey Highway licking love fucking son of a bitch. Shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up. Tired of you fucking people, man. I'm out here. I'm fucking giving you my fucking heart, fucking soul and shit. And what do you ass blast enthusiasts do, huh? What do you dingleberry written, fucking colon tenderizing, uh, fat slut taint looking piece of shit? What are y'all doing? What are y'all doing? Fucking pieces of fucking shit. Oh, uh, yeah, 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 fuck off. Job. All right, fuck off. You promised us, RG. The fund is not I didn't open. promise you Fire shit. Sale. Fire sale. Fuck you. Contribute hey, to the hey, RG fucking fund. asshole. I'm, I didn't promise you a goddamn thing, all right? And I'm not going to give you a goddamn thing. You know, the only thing that you trolls are going to get from me is this. This is, what, this is the only thing you fucking trolls are going to get from me. I'd buy that for a dollar. This dude really advocates World War III so young Americans can be sent to die in some middle of nowhere while his 400 pound assets You're taking care of America! Serving of 69 wings. You're taking Let's care of America! issues instead of murdering browns and slobs. Uh, look, you'd be fighting for America, alright? You have reaped the spoils of America, and if America needs to be defended, you people need to go out there and defend it, alright? Don't give me the shit! All right, don't give me this crap. Oh, I don't want to do it. I'm going to dodge the trap. Well, then get the fuck out of my country, you anti-American scum. Get the fuck out of my country. Son of a bitch. Anyway, I'm sorry, folks. All right, for the serious listeners out there, I'm sorry. All right. I'm out here trying to fucking spark synapses in the brains of folks out here, all right? I mean, I'm giving you the inside track on what the fuck is going on, and what are you people more worried about? You're more worried about licking a finger, putting it in your ass, and watching anime for the fucking whole weekend. Jesus fucking Christ, and belligerent Brian. I'd buy that for a dollar. Uh, you know what? Fuck you, Froppy, all right? Fuck you! Fuck you and the rest of you fucking traitorous bastards! Look, there's Vox Artificial still talking shit. Yeah, you know what, Vox? You're lucky you're not in front of me, boy. You're lucky you're not in front of me, boy. I'd slap the Canadian right out of you, boy. Son of a bitch. Hey, we got Froppy. I'm dodging that shit. You ain't dodging shit, all right? And if that's what you think, then get the hell out of my country, boy. All right? Get the fuck out of my country. And by the way, everybody at Rumble Chat, you fucking all take it in the ass, all right? 
Cat Cans definitely takes it up the fucking ass. And S. Ajax takes it up the fucking ass. William Bear Ass Travis takes it up the fucking ass. Wicked Man takes it up the fucking ass. Scorpio California takes it up the ass. Belligerent Brian takes it up the fucking ass. Dentarius takes it up the fucking ass. Captain Slap Nuts takes it up the fucking ass. Vorhood Merchant takes it up the fucking ass. Great Thunder takes it up the fucking ass. All right? All right? To when the Tornado Alias takes it up the fucking ass. Metric Chaotic takes it up the fucking ass. All right? Fucking piece of shit. <laughs> oh, look, now we got President J. Oh, great. What the actual fuck are we fighting these sand... Hey! Hey! Why must we start World War III? Nobody in America wants to go to war outside of neocons and liberals. You're gonna you're gonna defend your country, boy. All right. If if America needs defending, you people better defend her. Do you understand that? You fucking stupid fucking slime. And Cool Rock with a five dollar Rumble rant. Look at this. Look at this shit. Type dodge in chat if ghost is a draft dodging hypocrite. Oh fuck dodge. you, you piece dodge. of crap! Dodge. Fuck you! Dodge. Fuck you! Dodge. Dodge. Fuck you! Dodge. Shut dodge. that shit up! Anyway, cool rog over there with a rumble rat, five dollar rumble rat. Fuck him, ghost. You're goddamn right. Fuck them all, cool rod. Fuck them all. And belligerent Brian, why are you obsessed with what your fans do with their assholes? Because you're always saying and talking about it on Twitter. Jesus Christ, I mean, look at fucking Urinator. I had to fucking, I had to ban that idiot. And speaking of Urinator, look at this, there's this fucking idiot right here. Look at this. As a veteran, I condone the draft as a assist at all those that don't want to go. <laughs> and by the way, I'm a homosexual deviant. <laughs> and I got a, I got a grinder a profile that says, ass up, door open. <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ, Ghosty is a pothead. Will you answer the draft? Hey, if they want to take me, I'll go, all right? But I'm an old codger, all right? So while you guys are out there protecting the homeland or protecting the homeland from foreign uh, agents that are trying to go against us, I'm going to be right here taking care of America. Don't worry about me. I'll be taking care of America. All right? I'll be making sure the young men in America aren't as fruity, as pink team playing, as, as Hershey highway loving pieces of shit like you people. All right? That's what I'm going to do. And take that shit off the screen. What are you fucking doing? Jesus Christ. And Devious Dave, are you going to be at the Benai birth meeting next weekend? No, actually, I'm going to be with the Bohemian Grove. So, anyway. Anyway, but I'm, I'm, it's a joke. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. As a matter of fact, I'm on a flight out here, you know, in the next couple of minutes. I'm not even fucking joking. Anyway, just, just shut up, all right? Be gone, don't care. Be gone. All right, I'm sorry, folks. I mean, you know, whenever you're dealing with these trolls, you know, they, they sink you to their level. You know what I mean? They sink you to their level, for Christ's sake. Anyway, let me go ahead and take a look. And by the way, Bohemian Grove was not last week. It's every weekend at the latter part of July. So, uh oh the Bohemian Grove. Uh oh the Bohemian Grove. Anyway, I'm sorry. Let's get back on topic here. I'm joking about the Bohemian Grove shit, all right? I'm joking, all right? I don't like getting naked and rubbing up against redwood trees. It's not my thing, all right? It's not my thing. Give me a smoke. That's it. Got to hold it in and hit the brain. Ghost is skull and bones. No, that's part of that Yale University thing. I'm not part of that Yale University thing where everyone is pretty much a latent homosexual, all right? I'm, I'm not part of that, Tesla. I'm not a part of that, man. And, oh, Jesus. I'd buy that for a dollar. No, there's not going to be any fucking RG, dude. And official shekel counter, you always bring the conversation to gay I'd stuff. i that for a dollar. Yeah, just shut up. And, dude, look, Fox, fuck you, man. Aren't you going to go away? Aren't you going to go fuck away, man? Get the fuck away from me, man. Get the fuck away from me, man! Look at this fucking shit. As they say, the chat reflects the streamer, Shantae. Shantae! Oh, fucking give me a goddamn break, dude. Give me a fucking break. I mean, I I'm, I'm trying to give you guys legitimate information. All right, I know it's a baller Friday. I know everybody wants to celebrate the weekend. 
But by God, you guys are going to have to take something fucking serious. All right, anyway, look. What time is it? All right, just look, it's like almost six. All right, good. I can make it to fucking the bar. Is there any bare-knuckle boxing or some shit on tonight? I want to see some combat sports. I want to see blood tonight, all right? Because I had to deal with you stupid, four-eyed, freckle-faced, red-headed fucking stepchildren out here, all right? Fucking anal leakage fetish having freaks. Anyway, folks, I'm sorry that we went down this direction. I wouldn't be surprised if these were henchmen of Elon Musk and Peter Thiel and David Sachs. I would not be surprised. But I do want to remind everybody, it wasn't just big tech. Remember, it was also his <laughs> son. <laughs> Fuck you, man, you fucking Vox artificial. I'm going to call my fucking lawyer, Shekelstein Noseberg, and I'm going to see if I can get some kind of a fucking restraining order against you, man. I'm not fucking joking around. I'm not joking. I'm, not, I'm fucking, I am not kidding around. I'm calling Shekelstein Noseberg, which is my fucking lawyer, and let me tell you, I'm going to get some kind of, I'm going to get some goddamn restraining order on your ass. All right? I'm going to get a goddamn restraining order on your ass. And by the way, it was Trump's sons, as I've been stating. Take a look at this. All right, New York Times. Donald Trump Jr. is building a mega bench, and J.D. Vance is just the start. So as I was stating, folks, what we have here is mega. I'm talking Trump's sons. You've got big tech. And even those within the chattering class that have conspired against Trump in order for Trump to do their bidding. And you see, unfortunately, this is a side effect of what Trump has built. All right? And what Trump has built. And, oh, Jesus Christ. Come on, man! The hell is that supposed to mean? You want chun chun? Is that it? You want a little chun chun? Jesus Christ. I'd buy that Listen, dollar. shut the fuck up. There's not going to be any fucking radio graffiti. Jesus Christ, shut the fuck up. How much to make Vox a mod? Shekel got... Dude, Vox is never going to be a mod in any fucking room. All right? Jesus Christ. And uh, Devious Dave, I'll be looking for you at the Texas 8 Masonic Lodge after the show. I'm not at that lodge, by the way. Anyway, I'm of the uh, Manly P. Hall persuasion in which the universe is the architect's building, and we are just builders adding to the architecture. All right. Anyway, Tesla Cyberheart, uh, you could say that Trump has turned into the golem. And for all those that don't know what golem is, that is a Frankenstein that has gone rogue in the Jewish sense. All right. Anyway, once again, uh, Donald Trump Jr. I'd buy that for a dollar. Oh, dude, listen to me. Dude, listen. Listen. Uh, that's enough, dude. I don't... I am not doing radio graffiti. I am not doing radio graffiti. And urinator. Look at this. Hey, Pappy. I got to get some dinner. Can you start radio graffiti until I get back? I'll be back in 12 minutes. I'd buy that for a dollar. How much to make... Dude, listen, Vox, listen to me. I don't like you, all right? I don't like you. The Chad Reflection streamer. I don't like you. I'll never leave you, Dad. Make sure to buy me a couple of Dr. Peppers as so for banning me from Rumble Chat. And then there's Fruitcake Texan over here. Please put my $5 towards the Radio Graffiti Fund. And then you got Vox Art Officials. How much to make you a co-host? Uh, fuck No. How about that shit? Fuck no. Jesus Christ. Uh, hey, turn off the donos if they make you so mad, you spastic lunatic. Hey, Crow Manlet, let me tell you something. I don't know if you just found my show, but just sit there and shut your fucking fat mouth when you're talking to me, boy, all right? You don't know what the hell you're talking about. You're some Johnny-come-lately over here, all right? I'm broadcasting to the tens of thousands of people that listen to me throughout the world. That's who I'm broadcasting to, not to some dickless fucking idiot like you, you jerk off. Jesus fucking Christ, you see what I gotta fucking put up with, man? Come on! <laughs> hey, uh, fart? Fucking fart. Ghost on air. 
theories wild and bold, truth slips by, his tales unfold. Misinformation's constant song, in his world, facts are often wrong. Give me a break, I could have farted out a better fucking poem, alright? Give me a break. <laughs> And what is this, Gina Hunt? Oh, Jesus Christ, you guys are fu- you guys got to give me a fucking break. Ghost Winston lost his virginity. Are you proud? I don't believe that. I don't believe it, Helmet Boy. But thank you for for letting us know. All right, all right. Hold on, where are we at here? Put the PC shot on. Uh, we've got uh, what has eight balls and Mexicans? The lottery. Oh God, dude, what the fuck? We didn't need to fucking hear that shit. We didn't need to hear that shit. How much for 30 minutes of radio? How about no? Jesus Christ. And there's a crow man. Let's shut up. Isn't a comeback. You argue like a woman. You just insult and scream. Let me tell you something, crow man. I don't even know who the hell you are. All right. But if you've got some fucking balls, all right, the next time I do Radio Graffiti, you give me a call up, and I'll make you look lower than a leprechaun's nutsack, you fucking mental midget. Don't come up to my show acting like you're fucking Keith Oberman and shit, you stupid fucking fruit. Jesus fucking Christ, man. You see what the fuck I have to put up with with these fucking... My fans, by the way! My fucked up fucking shitbird fans, by the way! Now look at this five-finger prostate punch. Jesus, you're acting like a bitch today, Ghost. Vox intellectually blacked you. In, wait, intellectually blacked me? Are you fucking kidding me? Fuck you. And Vox Artificials, consider this and all the other donos this show as my contribution towards the radio graffiti fight. I'd buy that for a dollar. And look, American Anime Akotu, I don't know what you posted, but you didn't get it posted. You private it or something. I don't know what you're trying to show me. You probably show me one of these sick ass fucking photos I'd buy of anime. If you're tying mod slash co-host applications, then let me put my hat in the D- ring. I'm not getting you a co-host! Twice in your troll song. I am it's not! And everyone else Dude, in the song. fuck you, you trolls! Really love me. Love no, me. I don't! Also unban me on Rumble. I'm not! No! No! I hate you! Alright? President J. Box Artificials, I fucking hate you! Jesus Christ! And mod me coward with a $5 rumble rant. Uh, Radio Graffiti Fund dono. Handle it, Hambone. Oh, yeah. You're going to really make me do what you want by calling me a fucking Hambone. All right? I'm not a goddamn Hambone, you piece of shit. All right? If it wasn't for you trolls fucking just not leaving me alone, man. You're a fucking bad case of herpes. You never go away. I would be one of the biggest political commentators in today's America. But nobody takes me fucking serious because of you fucking trolls. Because of you pieces of shit, man. Fucking idiot. Hey, hold on. Uh, BV Den said, uh, Tours Radio Graffiti, thanks. I'm in the hospital. This will cheer me up. When is the fan meetup at Crossroads Mall? There ain't no fucking fan meetup. All right, I wouldn't want to meet any of you people. You understand that? I don't want to meet any of you people. Jesus Christ. I mean, do you think I want to get it public that I'm actually doing this shit? I'm a respected member of my community, for Christ's sake, man. I would shock a lot of people. All right, I wouldn't want any of you. I don't want to hang out with you people. I don't want to know you fucking people. All right? Jesus Christ, belligerent Brian, why am I so upset? Fucking you! All of you! That's why! <laughs> I'd buy that for a dollar. Oh, oh, look at this. You only have yourself to blame for nobody taking you serious. It's fucking you, dumb fucks. All right? It's fucking you! Dude, look at these people are like, hey, a fan meetup in San Antonio would be co- I don't want to meet you fucks! Do you understand that? I don't want to meet you fucking people. Oh, God. You know what? I'm getting out of here. You people have harshing my mellow. You fucking people are pissing me off. I don't want... I don't want it. All right? I don't fucking want it. Helmet boy, are you going to have a meet and greet at Anime NYC next month? I can set something up. (laughs) Fuck no. How about that shit? And look, five finger prostate punch. Fucking Vox didn't intellectually black anybody, you fucking cum gurgler. All right? Jesus Christ, you Gucci's having scat snorting piece of shit, man. All right, anyway, as I was stating, all right, I'm sorry. Once again, aside from 
Peter Thiel, Elon Musk, David Sachs. We got Trump's sons. Here you got Donald Trump saying, building a MAGA bench with J.D. Vance, some unknown lover of Peter Thiel, in my opinion. And it's not only that. I mean, we all saw uh, in the article that I posted yesterday that Trump was pressured by both of his sons. By both of them. At the last minute, I mean, you would think, okay, because this was a last-minute deal. According to reports, uh, you fucking piece of shit. What's the difference between a starving and an ambulance? Nobody laughs at an ambulance. Uh, t- just just please stop, all right? Type V if I won and ghost lost. Don't fucking type it, dude. Don't fucking ingratiate this Tard's ego, please, all right? Anyway, as I was stating, inside story of how Trump chose J.D. Van... What the fuck? I've seen better news commentary from Ink Cobra JFF. Oh, King Cobra. Uh, yeah. yeah, fuck you. Listen to me. You fucking pieces of shit. You keep fucking talking shit. I'm going to get the fuck out of here. I've got some more fucking shit I want to talk about out here. All right? It's serious fucking shit. I know it goes beyond your pay grade. I know it goes beyond your mental capacity. But this is fucking serious shit. And BV Dan, are you going to talk about the blue screen of death? I just fucking talked about it, man. I just fucking talked about it. It's unfortunate. I'm being bombarded by trolls, but I talked about it. All right, man. I think I'm pretty much done with this show, man. I'm not fucking joking. Let me see if I can take another hit of the tobacco, and hopefully that'll calm my ass down in order for me to continue with this goddamn fucking disgusting shitbird show. Please excuse me, all right? All right. Got to hold it in and let it hit the brain, all right? Hold it in and hit the brain. Ah, that's good. All right, that's good. And let me tell you something. If you people are pissed because I get this tobacco from a Mexican kid that sells candy apples on the corner, what are you people doing for minorities, huh? The fuck are you doing? I'm providing economic opportunity while you're... Providing people with grief, all right? So shut up. And look at this five finger prostate punch and show bitch cope and seethe. Look at this shit, all right? Look, look at that shit. Anyway, once again, it was his sons, all right? Right after. Oh, she, can Jesus fucking cry? Can you fuck off? Fuck off! Fuck off! Christ! Fucking Vox Artificial, you fucking piece of shit. As I was stating, all right, his sons pressured their father right after getting supposedly assassinated, attempted, and they forced him to pick J.D. Vance. All right, they forced him. On top of the names I mentioned earlier, Peter Thiel and Elon Musk, and David Sachs and Vivek Ramaswamy. I mean, they have a vested interest. In- I'd buy that. Oh, Jesus dollar. Christ. Can you fucking piss the fuck off? I'm trying to talk. I'm trying to fucking talk. I'd buy that for a dollar. Oh, my God. Well, hey, cheers to Flames were golfing. I know J- at least he's going to say something. She or they are going to say something decent. Let me go ahead and take a look at this. I'm sorry, all right? I'm sorry out here. And uh, Scott Moe says, I'll see you at Worst Fest in New Braunfels in September, brother man. Yeah, okay, you're, you're not going to know who I am. Don't worry about it. Anyway, Vox Art Officials, you didn't answer my question. Are you going to talk about CrowdStrike updating? I just fucking did. And you know it, you stupid fucking... St- oh, God. You know, I've heard you on Radio Graffiti, Vox. All right, you sound like a very effeminate man. You sound like the kind of man that wears legging jeans in order to show anal camel toe, all right? That's the kind of guy you sound like. Flames were golfing. Musk and Thiel are the PayPal mafia, and they elected Vance as vice president, who is connected to the tech industry. Check it out. Hey, I, that's what I've been trying to get across here, uh, Flames were golfing. That's what I've been trying to get across here. Unfortunately, I haven't been able to because these stupid fucking trolls! And look, we got Mega Max. One of my blacks, by the way. Cheers to Mega Max. One of my blacks. Cheers, dude. All right. Anyway, as I was stating before I got rudely interrupted, I'm, I'm trying to get everybody to understand what's going on here. 
All right, I, I, I've tried to lay it out what the fuck is going on, and you people are just fucking, you know, you're jerking off. Like I said, take a look at this. I think this crowd strike thing was a plan, just like this whole assassination attempt was by Big Tech, his sons. Every, take a look at this. Elon Musk mocks Microsoft amidst global outage crisis. I mean, he's mocking them. And what's going on to Twinkle Tard? Cheers to Twinkle Tard. Hey, Ghost. What up, Did Richard? Did you hear about that massive IT issue today? The one where crowd STRA oh, dude, y'all, caused now y'all are of pissing me off. to get the blue screen of death? You should really talk about oh, that instead Jesus of having your Christ. pissy pants tantrum about Trump. All right, I'm, I'm done. I'm fucking done with this fucking stupid show. I'm fucking done. Twinkle Tard. Hey, what's up, Ghost? I don't like J.D. Vance either. The guy looks like a 10-year-old with a beard. Well, aside from the way he looks, he looks very disingenuous when he comes across when communicating. And once upon a time, communication was a very integral part of being a politician. But in this day and age, it seems to me, you just have to be Peter Thiel's lover. Archie, please, Archie, please, Archie, please, Archie, please, Archie, please, Archie, Come on! Please, Archie, please, Come on! Why the fuck do you think I even should even give you fucks radio graffiti, man? This has been a fucking pain in the ass show, man. This has been a pain in the fucked up ass show. All right, man. I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry. By the way, we're trying to make this fucking show troll free. All right. So please consider becoming a basic member of the True Capitalist Radio membership because. If you can't stand these trolls, man, please consider it. I'm going to be in that chat room right after this broadcast uh, for a little bit. Then I'm going to go to the bar. I don't want to fucking... I, I, I got to fucking let loose, dude. I mean, especially after this bullshit. And hold on. Five Finger Prostate Punch, do Radio Graffiti so Vox can black you again. Oh, yeah. Can I, uh, hi, this is Vox Ghost. Fuck you, man. Oh, that's right. He's Canadian. Fuck you, eh? Fucking hoser. Anyway, cheers to Twinkle Tard, and, uh, you know, once again, cheers to uh, Red Ball, who hooked it up with uh, 40 beers, and uh, cheers to the Northern Yankee, who hooked it up with 69 beers, and I don't know why Vox keeps fucking donating. I fucking can't stand the guy. He's like, I love you, Dad. I love you. <sighs> All right, look, I'm kind of done. I'm kind of done with this broadcast. Whatever I try to convey on here, you people don't listen. You don't care. And it's kind of like, oh, God. Chad wins, I win. See you uh, guys on X. So look, there it is. You don't win a goddamn thing, you stupid Canadian bacon moose humping piece of fucking Mountie loving shit. You don't win a goddamn thing, Vox. How the fuck do you think you win shit? How does that work? Can somebody explain that stupid, dumb, like, kind of tarted... Troll mentality. Can somebody explain that shit? <sighs> All right, man. I'm just. I'm. I'm done. Helmet boy. If you don't do radio graffiti, just know we still appreciate you. Oh, look at helmet boy. Huh? Look at helmet boy. <sighs> All right. All right. I'm sorry. Let me just try to calm my ass down because uh, you know, folks. I'm. I'm trying here. All right. You. You folks hear me? I'm fucking trying. And every time I try to convey something that's very important on this broadcast, all we get is the stupidity on a consistent and habitual basis. And you know what? I'm, I'm gonna, you know, cheers to the folks on D Live. You know what? Let me let's give D Live some more lemons, dude. All right, let's give D Live another two thousand lemons. Let's go ahead and do it. Hell with it. All right, two thousand lemons to D Live out there. Cheers to everybody out there in D Live. That's actually the most chill chat room. I don't know what the hell happened to Rumble. Uh, YouTube isn't too bad. YouTube isn't too bad, dude. And what is this? I'm sloppy drunk, man. Go cans.wave. We love you. Vox, dude, what is your fucking problem, man? I mean, what is your fucked up fucking shitbird problem? Oh, my God. All right. Anyway. Dude. First of all, I got Mega Max because your bitch... Because you always bitch and cry. Fuck you. And cat cans with a $20... With a rumble rant, man? Come on! Radio Graffiti Funner, just buy yourself a couple of drinks. 
Dude, come on, man. I, I Dude, don't make me do radio graffiti here, please, dude. Seriously, don't make me fucking do this. I don't want to do it. I don't want to do it. I want to get the fuck out of here. I want to go chat with the True Capitalist radio members for about an hour. And then I want to go to the bar and go fucking guzzle down some fucking 29 degree goddamn beer from Draft Taps. Served in ice cold mugs. Served to me with, with some scantily clad 24 year old bimbos giving me the shit. Alright, with sports on the screen all over the place. That's what I want to do. Alright. That's what I want to do. And hey, whims of Mim in the fucking YouTube, go fuck yourself. How about that shit? Get the fuck out of here. All right, get the fuck out of here. and Don't ever come back. Get him out of here. Get that piece of shit out of here. All right, hide him out of here. Get him out. I don't want him in my fucking shit. Get him out. Get him out of here. All right, I'm not taking shit from nobody. All right, I'm not taking shit from anybody, man. This is my fucking show. All right, this is my goddamn show. And if I want to do radio graffiti, I'll do it when I want to, man. I'm not going to sit here and submit to a bunch of fucking idiots that are out here that are fucking fruiting up on a goddamn fiber optically connected world that we call the internet, boy. I'm tired of it. I'm tired of it. Jesus fucking Christ. And with five finger prostate punch, either way, you're doing it. You're dan dance for the shekels. I'd buy that dude, for a dollar. You son of a bitch, dude. Don't call me some fucking shekel goblin or whatever the fuck you people call me, man. Alright. What? Remember Fweens. To aquapatized audio is a safe space for you and all of you, you Fweens. What? Copy ghosty wubbies you fawuber and uber. By the way, Wemember. The Jewies are you, you Fweens. And vote Wepubwekin because the only good goy is a contro udgoy. What I'd the fuck are you talking dollar. about? Face it, ghost. You're our bitch. Uh, dude. I always win. No. How do you fucking win? All right? How the fuck do you fucking win? I don't fucking get it. How the fuck do you win? And by the way, the Fifth Collective, I know you just donated. I don't know why it's not showing up on the goddamn screen here. Hold on just a second. I know you, uh, Fifth Collective, I know you just donated a... a a fucking buy me a coffee. I have no idea why it's not, not showing up on the screen. The fuck? Did you take it off for some shit? What the hell's that about? Anyway, I do want to acknowledge that fifth collective. I don't know what the hell happened there. Anyway, folks, look, don't make me do a radio graffiti, man. I fucking don't want to do it. All right? I don't want to fucking do it. I, why do you think I didn't even want to do the damn ghost show tonight, man? All right, I wanted to go into this weekend with a decent level head instead of being all fucking wound up and pissed off because of you people, man. Every fucking time. Every fucking time I get pissed off. Every fucking time it just fucking ruins my shit. I'd buy that for a dollar. Vox Artificials, it's true. President Jay won this time. I concede to him. And here, here's the fifth collective, by the way. Put the PC shot on. Uh, you asked us to explain we win logic. The reason we say we win, because despite your claims of manly dominance, you always succumb and bitch to uh, uh, bitch out under our pressure when we troll you on Radio Graffiti. I mean, seriously, do you remember the end of the last... Uh, dude, I don't want to talk about the end of the last True Capitalist Radio show, all right? Go fuck off, all right? Yeah, fuck you, fifth collective, all right? Fuck you with no Vaseline, you fucking rose-butted asshole having freak. All right, anyway, I'm sorry. All right, let me take some smoke and let me attempt to continue because I got other fucking news here, but I, I don't think y'all care. All right, I don't think y'all give a shit. Y'all are fanning your nuts to the fucking stupidity that's grow going on here, so I don't even know why. I don't even know why I'm bothering. All right, give me a smoke here, all right? That's it. Got to hold it in, hit, hit the brain. Look, I'll tell you what. I'll do radio graffiti if somebody can give me a case. All right? Somebody persuade me. All right? Pretend that I've got, you know, some people hostage in Minecraft. And I'd like for you to persuade me. Like, look, ghost, it doesn't have to be this way. All you have to do is just give the hostages to me and come over. And we can have radio graffiti. And everything will be just fine. Everything will be just good. That's the way it is. All right. So give me a break. All right. 
Uh, radio graffiti will calm my nerves. Buy that for a dollar. Who do you like more, Sally Acorn or Bunny Rabbit? Who the fuck are? Who the hell is that, Gino? Are you trying to come out as a furry or something? Who the fuck is that? And Vox Art Officials, the case is I'm better than you. How the fuck are you better than me, Vox? All right. How the fuck do you figure that? And who the hell is Sally Acorn and Bunny Rabbit? And Helmet Boy, if you do Radio Graffiti, we won't ask for a ghost show this weekend. Well, I plan on doing one Sunday because I know I, I need to do one, you know? Belligerent Brian, it's quite simple. It'll make you feel better knowing you made your fans' day. I don't want to make your fucking day. You have harshed my mellow today. Why the fuck would I want your day to be great and y'all are leaving me like I'm fucking chewed up, stirred fried shit? Jesus Christ, you selfish autist. You know that? I blame your dirty dish rag whore mothers, man. And Eddie three two four seven five eight Vox is one hundred percent correct. He ain't he ain't shit. All right, he ain't fucking shit. <laughs> I'd buy that oh product. God! You keep calling us gay, but you do realize being overly emotional is a feminine trait. Oh bullshit! Your probably a tranny. No, fuck you, man! I'm a fucking angry motherfucker. That's what I am. All right, I'm filled with piss and fury. For fuck's sake, I'm a bad motherfucker. That's why. All right. You come up to me, get me angry, boy. You better fucking run for cover, all right? Because I'm a, I'm a dangerous man, all right? Like I said, I could clinch my fists, put them in my goddamn pockets, step outside my goddamn house, and be arrested for lethal weapons. So don't sit here and try to talk garbage to me over here, all right? Son of a bitch. I'm not even fucking joking around. I've told you time and time again, I would stomp your teeth so far down your goddamn throat that you'd be able to chew your own chocolate starfish, you fruity son of a bitch. So sit there and shut up and fucking shut your mouth when you're talking to me, boy. And we got Devious Dave. I'm working a 16 both Saturday and Sunday. 30 minutes of radio graffiti isn't that much to ask. Oh, look at now they're trying to they're trying to sympathy. They're trying to the sympathy route, huh? Uh, they're trying the sympathy route. Uh, that's great. That's great. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, let's pull on the heartstrings of old ghost over here and see if that works. All right. Hey, ain't no love where I'm from, boy. All right. Ain't no love where I'm from. And Five Finger Prostate Punch, I paid for a radio graffiti last show and you didn't even pick me up. I was, dude, listen to me. I don't know your fucking number, all right? I just pick random fucking shit based on the fucking switchboard that I have. Jesus Christ, dude, you're saying that I'm crying like a woman? You people are, are crying like you've had a bad period, all right? And it's smelling up the place like fucking rotting fish and shit. Shut the fuck up. All right, folks. Look, what the I'd fuck? Buy that for a dollar. Radio graffiti, or I'll Bud Dwyer myself. Don't even kid around about that. All right, Froppy. Seriously, dude. All right, no, I'm not fucking joking around. I'd buy that for a dollar. Oh no, here's an audio file again. For fuck's sake, no, please, man. Get to RG. What? Get to radio graffiti. What the fuck? Get to RG plays. Radio what the fuck? Oh, ghost. My balls are hot. What? Oh, ghost. I want to suck on your toes. You sick son Plus, of a bitch. Let me lick your feet. You sick and son of a bitch. And when we are done, you sick son of a bitch. We can walk. Who who did that? Who the fuck did that, man? Who the hell created that on Suno and then fucking donated that shit? You're making it into a fruit bowl Friday, man. It's a baller Friday, asshole. And oh, look, we got Twinkle Tard with a $50 Rumble Rant radio graffiti fun on behalf of Devious Dave since he has to work a double shift at Whataburger. I used to love Whataburger. I used to love that burger. Then the, the fa it was a family business. And then they sold it to some fucking, I don't know, firm out of Chicago, and now it sucks a cock with it. But anyway, don't mean to uh, digress. I guess you people are going to be obligating me to this fucking radio graffiti shit, huh? I think that, I, that, is that what I'm gathering here? Huh? Y'all are pretty much obligating me to this fucking radio graffiti bullshit. 
All right. All right. Anyway, I guess I am obligated. And for all those that don't know, okay, I, I tried to show the connections between the GOP and their coup that is happening on their party by big tech, by Trump's sons, and by the chattering class, like people are like Cucker Carlson and that sort of thing. Unfortunately, it's been derailed because I wouldn't be surprised if these people are working for Peter Thiel or, or, or Elon Musk or one, David Sachs or Ackerman or one of those fucking billionaires, and they are derailing my show. They are derailing my show. And Eddie, three, two, four, seven, five, eight, get, uh, Ghost would eat 12 burgers a day before Whataburger was sold. I actually really liked Whataburger. I'm not even joking. I even ate it for fucking Thanksgiving one day. I'm not even jo- I'm not kidding. I'm not joking around. Those many years ago, but still. You know, I like being unconventional. You know, I don't like people telling me what the fuck to do. You know what I'm saying? I, I, I've always been somebody, I, I, you know, I fucking hated it. You know, when I was in kindergarten, you know, I would never cover color in the lines. I didn't like coloring in the lines. You want to know why I didn't like coloring in the lines? Because the fucking teacher was telling me to fucking color in the lines. I, I, I'm a fucking rebel, man. All right. I don't like people telling me what to do and when to fucking do it, man. And that's why I love it being in this country. That's why I love being a capitalist. That's why I love it. Anyway, sorry. Ghost had trouble reading. Yeah, fuck you, asshole, all right? Stupid son of a bitch. Oh, so edgy. You're goddamn right I was edgy, all right? I didn't want to color in the lines, man. All right, I was fucking... I was a rebel, all right? What are you fucking talking about out here? And I'm not dyslexic, dude. I'm tired of you people fucking making that false indictment that I'm dyslexic, all right? Stupid son of a bitch. Oh, I was an autist? Fuck you. For saying, you know, kick that asshole out of here who said that I was an autist. Kick that fucker out of here right the fuck right now. Don't you ever call me a fucking autist or an Asperger or whatever the fuck. Spectrum, don't ever fucking compare me to that dumb shit. Don't you ever. Don't you dare. Jesus fucking Christ. Hold on, let me, let me take another smoke here. And I guess, I guess we'll get to Radio Graffiti. And hold on, BV Dan, Whataburger for Thanksgiving is just sad. What happened to your life when you did that? What are you talking about, man? All right, I was hosting. Everybody comes to my house, all right? And because everybody, every time they come to my house, Thanksgiving and Christmas, they all want money. All right, I'm the patriarch, you know, I'm I'm a capitalist. So every fucking time the family gets together, they, they're going to hit me up for money. And I knew they were going to hit me up for money on Thanksgiving. So instead of having all the spread and shit, and this is during the time I, I actually was pro-Trump. I was inspired to do this by Trump because remember he invited some fucking team or some shit to the White House and fed him fucking McDonald's and shit. That's why I did it. Because I knew these fucking people were going to hit me up for money. And if they're going to hit me up for money, I'm not going to give them the fixings. Are you fucking kidding me? I'm not buying, you know, prime rib and, and all that bullshit. Fuck that shit. You, you're you going to eat a burger and, because I like it. Because I want to. I'm not even bullshitting. You can even loo it up. It's actually one of the signs of autism. Can you even what? Can you even look it up? It, uh, fuck you. Uh, not coloring in the lines is autism. Fuck you, I'm not autistic. And anybody who fucking says that, I'm kicking you out of my chat rooms. I don't give a shit what chat room you're in. If you call me an autist, I'm kicking you the fuck out. All right? Fucking piece of shit. I'm not joking around. I'm not a fucking autist. Jesus fucking Christ. All right, let me... Poverty dinner? Yeah, that's the point. All right? That, hey, you're going to come to me on the holiday of Thanksgiving, and you're going to ask me for money. You're eating a fucking Whataburger, all right? And guess what? You're eating it the way I like it, all right? And I like it with everything with no tomato, all right? And you're going to eat it. You're going to fucking like it. And if you don't fucking like it, I'm not giving you money. How do you like that shit? Nobody. And guess what? Everybody in the family enjoyed it. Everybody in the family was like, oh, wow, God, this is great. This is so great. Yeah, because they needed the fucking money, all right? Because they needed the fucking money. So anyway, that's the beautiful part about being a capitalist, all right? I mean, you know that people are going to hit you up for money. Have some fun with this shit. You know what I mean? Hey, you going to fucking come to Thanksgiving? We're eating Whataburger. How do you like that shit? 
And if you don't like it, then get the fuck out. Don't even bother coming. Everybody came. Everybody enjoyed it. It was fucking good. It was actually a very good time. It it provided a different avenue to look at the occasion. So, anyway. And uh, Helmet Boy said, I was a rebel in elementary school. I grabbed my first grade teacher by the neck while the administrators took me out of the room. <laughs> And I said in a Terminator voice, I'll be back. What's Ghost's favorite internet provider? Spectrum. Do you know, President Jay, I'm not going to do Raider Graffiti because of you, you fucking prick. All right, I was just about to fucking do it. I was just about to fucking do it. And then President Jay, with his stupid two-bit fucking jokes.com ripoffs, had to come along and talk shit. How about shutting the fuck up? I was just about to do it. How about shutting the fuck up? Jesus fucking Christ. Oh, you're obligated, Ghost. Oh, you're, ob you're ob I'm not obligated to do a goddamn thing. The only thing I'm obligated to do is stay white and die. All right? That's the only thing I'm obligated to do, boy. Give me a smoke. I'm sorry. I'm going to hold it in and let it hit the Marine, all right? Hold it in and hit the Marine. All right. And reminder, Ghost buys his family Chinese knockoff electronic. Who fucking, who cares? All right? So what? I don't give a fuck. You think I give a fuck? Look, for all those that are wondering, because there's some fucking jerk off over there at fucking YouTube talking shit. All right? Let me tell you what I'll do. And I'm going to give you all my, my, my secret that I do every fucking Christmas. All right? And you're going to thank me. You people are going to thank me. I'm not fucking joking around. There is a place that is a Chinese website that takes PayPal. I'm not even joking around. I'm not sponsored by these people, but take a look at this, all right? China Vasion, all right? Take a look at this. I'm not even joking around. I'm not even joking around. You can get fucking high-grade electronics at, like, a fucking massive wholesale discount, and you don't have to buy a bulk, all right? You just have to buy, you know, you know... Like one or two, you have to, I mean, and I'm telling you this right now. Every time I buy gifts from here and give them to my family, they think that I'm the coolest fucking family member ever. Like anything tech, they're like, "Oh my god, wow!" I'm not even joking around. When drones first came out, uh, they fucking China Vision was uh, selling them like fucking twelve years ago. All right, I purchased like a few of them because they were very cheap over here they were like a hundo you know and they were like fucking legit badass fucking uh uh drones and i fucking handed them out to the kids and they fucking loved they thought i was the shit you know what i mean and, and every one of the kids and everybody they thought that i paid like a thousand dollars for them. <laughs> come on come on all right come on i bought like phones for them that are like fucking 40 bucks that you could probably find in America, you know, similar type for like 400. You know, come on, I know what I'm doing. Come on. You were never going to do RG cause you're afraid I'll humiliate you. All right. Well, I'm going to do radio graffiti, all right? I'm I'm going to do radio graffiti, all right? I mean, everybody's been especially, you know, the fo uh Redbow uh, that uh, did uh the 40 beers and Yank y y fucking Northern Yankee and Twinkle Tard and all those. We're going to go ahead and do it. But well, wait a minute. Why are you calling me a Jew? Why are you calling me a Jew? Look, there's, first of all, that's derogatory. But secondly, I think this is smart thinking. All right? I mean, you could buy electronics that are... I mean, I mean, everybody likes electronics, dude. You could buy this, like, fucking ultra cheap and then give it away at Christmas, and they think that you've spent thousands and thousands of dollars on them, when in actuality, all you did was spend like a few hundred bucks. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Hey, I was just fucking giving you guys the heads up. All right, folks. I guess it's about that time. All right, for everybody's favorite part. Hold on, wait a minute. Bob, Tom, only go down that low. Hey, they're still getting electronics. What are you talking about? What? I gotta go fucking buy it from, what, Best Buy or Circuit City or whatever the fuck? I don't have time to go to Circuit City. Ain't nobody got time for that. Alright, I fucking order it from China. They get here, and I undercut Circuit City. Alright, so go fuck off. Alright, I, I don't need to go through Circuit City. I can go right to the goddamn producer. 
Here, give me a smoke here. I'm sorry. All right. Got to hold it in. Get the brain, all right? All right. It's about that time for everybody's favorite part of the broadcast, I guess. And I'm talking about radio graffiti! Buy that for a dollar. Ghost runs his place Lee a cruise ship during holidays. The best food, the best booze, the finest cigars, and boat act comedian for entertainment. Only Ghost wouldn't be qualified for that job, since a pair of sea legs are required for that war. Uh, yeah, fuck you. Fuck you. All right, pair of sea legs. Fucking son of a bitch. Anyway, if you want to participate in radio graffiti... All you've got to do is call that number that's right above the buymeacoffee.com slash ghostpolitics box on the screen there, 667-770-1015, and once the operator bitch starts talking, push in the code 844286, and once you do, you will be in queue to be a part of Radio Graffiti. And by the way, I'm probably going to have to shut down the stream on YouTube because YouTube, I mean, you know, they're not going to allow a lot of this over here, all right? I mean, it's just, uh, you know. So we, we want to continue broadcasting on YouTube. We know we have a lot of YouTube folks over there. So let me go ahead and post the, uh, I, mean, po I mean, somebody, here, let me, let me, let me get the uh, Rumble, all right? So everybody can go to Rumble or DLive, either one. We're on DLive.tv slash ghost politics. Or let me go ahead and post the... Uh, the actual so everybody can go. Oh, whoa, oh, oh, whoa, oh, whoa. Don't echo, echo. Here it is. Here is the rumble. There is the rumble link. Oh, I put it in the Jesus Christ. I'm sorry. That was boomer versus technology. Here it is. All right. There's the rumble chat. Or there's the rumble link. And if you want to go on D Live, it's also available. Let me go ahead and show you all that. Although some people will tell you not to go there, but it's up to you. All right. Whatever stream gets you better. There it is right there. Anyway, for all the folks over there at YouTube, uh, my apologies that we have to do this, but YouTube is rather strict. All right, so we're going to do Radio Graffiti, and it's going to be very rambunctious, and uh, we, we just want to be safe with old YouTube, all right? So anyway, cheers to everybody on YouTube. Happy Baller Friday, and thank you very much for tuning in with me once again on the True Capitalist Radio broadcast on this Baller Friday. I hope or at least I wish that we would have gotten into some serious issues. We kind of did, uh, but uh, we went this weird fucking direction, so I, I have no idea. So anyway, cheers to everybody out there. Uh, if you want to listen to the Radio Graffiti portion live, go to the other links that I just posted in the YouTube chat room, the Rumble chat or the dlive.tv slash ghostpolitics. And by the way, if you haven't done so, uh, follow me on X, all right? Follow me on X if you haven't already done so. The Ghost Report, all one word, no underscores. The Ghost Report, all right? Anyway, folks, thank you all over there at YouTube. Cheers to all of you. And until next time, I'm out of here. <laughs> Woo!